Welcome back to TBL's continuing coverage of America Under Attack. What we're going to bring for you now is just an update on the situation as we have, as well as just the current situation and how things are going. We are going to be crossing live very soon to the President's address on the nation. But at the moment, we're basically just going to recap things here. Uh, basically, at quarter to nine this morning, the first plane hit the World Trade Centers now, and the footage you are now watching is actually amateur footage supplied to us by a group of local firemen that were actually filming a documentary today. Uh, about 15, 20 minutes later, the second tower was struck by another plane, hijackers also using this plane to fly into the Trade Center. Um, this footage captured earlier by CNN as well as some local filmmakers. Uh, around this time also the Pentagon in Washington was attacked as well as another plane was brought down in Pennsylvania somewhere. It is believed that this could have been targeted towards the White House. That is unconfirmed reports. Uh, and then also about half an hour to an hour later the both trade centers collapsed first. The uh, first one, the left side, collapsed as you are watching now and about 20 minutes later the second tower collapsed. Uh, this of course was caused flying debris just going hurtling down towards the people below and with all the firemen and police in the building there. At the moment the death toll is rumored to be around 5,000. That is unconfirmed and it could rise to anywhere to 20,000 people. This of course includes all the firemen and police officers that ran into the building trying to save the people. And we also have footage now that may be disturbing to some viewers. This is of uh, someone who was stuck in the building trying to get out of course jumping to their death as you can see now. Very disturbing pictures and we apologize to the families of the victim. We are receiving unconfirmed reports that there has been another attack. This is unconfirmed. This is in Chicago towards the uh, Sears Tower. This building has been closed uh, for some time now. This is unconfirmed reports that a fourth plane, apologies, a fifth plane has crashed and obviously has been hijacked but again this is all unconfirmed we cannot confirm this at this present time but please stay tuned for that uh, we are waiting of course to go live to the president's address but that is still a good 10 minutes away we've received some information now from the uh, United States safety uh, area the bureau sorry apologies here with some technical problems but basically, they're alerting citizens, American citizens, to please just to stay clear of any major attractions, major areas in their city, whether it be uh, tourist attractions, large buildings, anything like that. Basically, stay away from these. And if you're an American overseas or abroad who is watching this, please stay, be alert, be alert, be very alert. Do not go towards any... Uh, area which may be a threat or a danger because obviously this is an attack on America and Americans and this could be uh, you could be in danger that's basically what we're saying um, just looking again at some footage here of the attacks this is the uh, second plane flying into the towers and um, obviously a lot of damage and chaos caused now just an update, the uh, attack in Chicago has been, that has not happened, that was a, uh, as I mentioned, unconfirmed report, and that has now been, uh, that has not happened, we apologize for the, uh, the, the mistake there. Uh, and also, just updating, all airports and airspace above America has been closed, uh, if you have a flight today, there is no way that you'll be able to get out of the country, and there are no planes going out or in. So all airports closed, and most major areas, as I mentioned, do not go to, but they have been closed. The Empire State Building in Manhattan has been closed. The Sears Tower, which we had believed to be under attack, which now we know is not, is also closed, as well as major areas. And so, again, warning all citizens to please stay away from areas, and do not bring attention to yourself if you are an American overseas.